Uh, this is Paul. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. Non prohibiting polygraphing uh, rape victims. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, over 35 states, District of Columbia, and U.S. Virgin Islands have adopted laws addressing domestic and sexual violence, mm -hmm. stalking in the workplace. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is there a reason why each of the litigants don't get different protection orders? Yeah. Mm -hmm. One expires before the other. Mm -hmm. Does having two protection orders prevent either one from talking to each other, harassing each other, assaulting each other? No. Mm -mm. No. <laughs> Why is it that you had me arrested five months uh, after issuing a 10-year protection order? Yes. Why didn't my wife motion the court to have it reissued for another 10 years? Ouch! Well, I don't. Why don't you understand? Yeah. You can't have two protection orders. Poop. Mm -hmm. You can't petition the court to renew a protection order. Yes. When you're on trial for the accusation of violating the protection order. Yes. I can't get a protection order just because you got a protection order. Yes. Protection orders don't work that way. Now, I'm going to want to sue you. Ouch. I'm going to want you to go to jail, uh, William Kniebs. Yeah. Commissioner Basin. Um, are you going to prison? Ouch. Now. I gave in March, yes, of 2016, yes, to, um, well, it looks myself, but I would think somebody else, yes, um, could have been Bruce Hanfi, right, I'd be at the library until 10.30 a.m., yes, do I have to go to court today, ouch, why am I going to court, right now, now, um, as I said, yes, the protective order was not issued according to the VAW provisions, and the rest was illegal. Yeah. Uh, hi, Paul. Oh, I filed a motion to dismiss mm -hmm. March 7th of uh, 2016. Uh -huh. Have a response from the prosecutor received today. Oh, wreck day. Mm -hmm. I would rather talk to you in person and discuss things via, uh, rather than uh, talk to you in person that discuss things via email. Mm -hmm. That's why I've asked you to make another appointment. Po, po, po. <laughs> well, here's the problem. Mm -hmm. See you in court tomorrow. Ouch! Why am I going to court? Right now! Uh, June 3, March 7, 2016. Yeah. Stan, uh, it's Paul Budnick. Po. And you represented me during my court trial in Clallam County <laughs> when I was found not guilty. Oh, oh, oh. Mm -hmm. At that time, we did not see, yes, the significance of the VAWA uh -huh, as, uh, oof, as it pertains to the rights of the respondent. Yes. Mm -hmm. As you well know, I was arrested for the alleged violation of the protective order. Yes protective that was renewed without myself being served yes before the court reissued it yeah mm -hmm. i wasn't served before you reissued mm -hmm. that violates my rights as a respondent yeah to have two protective orders yeah to have you renew a protection order while i'm on trial for violating protection order. right now looking at the vawa the protection provisions guarantees that i can have uh, arrested mm -hmm. And can sue, yes, every individual involved in violating my rights as a respondent. Yeah. Now, uh, Stan, I have emailed Bruce Anafee, mm -hmm. my public defender, yeah, and have told the public defender's office that I am suing every attorney, yeah, and employee in that office for violating, yes, my due process rights. Mm -hmm. That goes for Stan Myers. Yes, he's getting sued. Right. Every public defender right now. Now, uh, my rights as the respondent. Yeah. You can't renew a protection order. Yes. When the individual is on trial for the accusation of violating protection. Right now,